Today we're going to be doing the Xbox One S HDMI port and uh, I just finished taking all the screws apart. I'm gonna take off the uh, lid really quickly. Um, and uh, the components are all loose because all the screws are off. Um, if we take a look at the port itself, it does not look damaged at all, but if you do a wiggle on the screen, uh, you do get a uh, an issue. So let's uh, let's do the screen uh, test just to show you what I'm talking about. Okay, so we have it hooked up. Uh, right now, we're gonna hook it up to the TV. Um, let's power it on. TV is on, and boom, you get this little mini message video, um, no signal, and then if you move it to the side, it says an incompatible video signal, and so if you do shake it around, there is a little bit of play of connectivity and disconnectivity, which tells us the port is bad. Um, it doesn't tell us uh, more than that, uh, because there could be multiple problems. Um, with this box, you know, having to have a port replacement done doesn't mean that you're going to get a picture. So uh, let's go ahead and do the HDMI port swap on this one. So we actually uh, removed the uh, port and we swapped it over to the other side. Um, we're going to take a look into the... Uh solder job here a little bit closer on the microscope and um yeah looks looks perfect actually looks really good and this is uh this is uh perfect um, all we gotta do now is uh, add the legs. So you see how these these are incorrect legs. You cannot solder something, and your legs look like this. If you soldered it, um, the legs and they 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 have holes right there. See right there, there's a hole. It's not it's not coming through from the bottom side. So that means your legs are not correct. You gotta redo the legs. So we're gonna do the legs right now, and we're gonna um, put it back together, and we're gonna test. Um, and see if it was just only an HDMI port because it seems like it could be a little bit more than that. Um, okay. So as you can see here with the uh, legs soldered on properly, you see that puddle. Um, it's got the solder in. Um, this one is probably 90%. It actually should need a little bit more than that to cover that. Um, but if we take a look at the uh, other side of this board um, you'll see that that is a proper leg actually this is one this one is one plus ten percent it's a little bit extra this is a little bit extra it's over okay but um, as long as you over is better on legs over is better under is not that good because then you don't have a full solid um, port Okay. So now uh, we got everything connected um, to the HDMI port and uh, we're going to give it a whirl. The hard drive doesn't sound too healthy on this thing. and uh, But there you go. HDMI port, it was bad. Um, the only thing that made me think that this uh, system was having other issues just the sound of the hard drive was a little loud, so maybe it's about to go. Um, but also, um, it seemed that sometimes sometimes ports, when you wiggle them around, you actually see a picture. This one almost got the picture, but then it gives you the same kind of result. Um, usually, that's the uh, HDMI chip. So, all right. Um, hopefully, this could help somebody else out, and uh, hopefully, I can uh, create some of these tech logs. Yeah.